At around midday on Thursday social media went into meltdown. A succession of tweets brought a sudden halt to the transfer saga of the summer. But confirmation that Manchester United had cooled their interest in Antoine Griezmann raised more questions than it answered. High-ranking sources at Old Trafford insist Jose Mourinho's priorities have shifted in light of Slayton Ibrahimovic's knee ligament damage. On face value, it's a plausible explanation. At least it would have been if not for the fact that figures that United were indicating as recently as last week that Griezmann remained a target. Marin Hall has known since April that Ibrahimovic would not be available for the start of next season, if not the rest of 2017. The decision is likely to have caught Griezmann by surprise, given that he rated his chances of a move to Old Trafford a 6 out of 10 just days prior. So to the reasoning. The idea Marinho needs an orthodox striker, rather than a man who scored 85 goals in three seasons for Atletico Madrid, doesn't stand up to close scrutiny. Nor does the implication United couldn't recruit a number 9 and a number 10 in one transfer window. What is accepted is that Griezmann was identified as a player to supplement Ibrahimovic rather than replace him. And the Swedes' injury has left a significant void to fill, even if there were no guarantees he would extend his one year contract at the club. Even replacing the 35-year-old with Andrea Bellotti or Romelu Lukaku both under consideration would still leave United in a similar position to the past campaign when Mourinho so bemoaned his side's lack of ruthlessness. Ibrahimovic scored 28 goals before his injury in the Europa League quarter-final against Anderlecht on April 20. His successor would do extremely well to match that return. Griezmann was identified because of his ability to give Mourinho's side a new dimension up front. There is a very real prospect that in merely replacing Ibrahimovic, United's attack will be weakened. Such was the Swedes' impact of last season. Crucially, United have made it clear they have not abandoned all interest in Griezmann. Given Atletico's transfer ban, which expires after the current window, a renewed bid could come in January or next summer. Perhaps United believe they can afford to wait, with other suitors unwilling to meet the striker's £87 million buyout clause. It is a risky game to play in a pivotal window for Mourinho when he can't afford to make misstep. He has limited his targets to four key acquisitions to turn United from EFL Cup and Europa League winners to genuine title challengers.